Yeah, hello, I'm uh, Mikael Norgård. I'm going to present you an, an idea I got actually when I was working with uh, the Topelius project for uh, Svenska Literaturselskapet. I didn't really put that much t thought into it then, but now these two days I've been um, thinking about it more and <laughs> made a presentation about it. So it's about um, placement of European content in mainstream uh, video games. And um, how to do that is um, you can use the European content in the game environment itself as uh, secrets that can be collected and you gain uh, achievements that is very common now, nowadays in Xbox 360 games and PlayStation 3 games. Or they could be Easter eggs or even uh, used in the actual storyline. For example, interviews from historical persons that And examples of this could be um, like paintings on the wall and um, that could be um, activated to, um, to show the information, description, what the actual painting is. Or you, there could be books in shelves which is, uh, that could show ex excerpts of the book. This is common in role-playing games, but with made-up stories. And uh, it could be music or interviews on tape recorders lying around somewhere. Or letters or photos on a desk. So the letters could be from a correspondence, interesting correspondence, you find uh, parts of this correspondence around in the environment. And uh, why do this? Well, it's a um, it's, uh, possibility to take part of the cultural heritage uh, in a more passive manner, reaching people um, that may be are not familiar with Europeana and, and historical uh, paintings and so And um, so you can, uh, by this you can reach new audience, especially young people that may not be interested in it. Or they don't know they are interested in history yet. Uh, so, and uh, this is uh, approaching the game industry in a natural way, not forcing um, a game to be, to include his historical data, but... And uh, this would be good marketing for uh, Europeana, and um, it uh, gives uh, the game company a professional appearance for wanting to have a... Uh, uh, real content in their games, which is good marketing for the company. Yes, that's my idea. It's um, an idea, um, more than a concept, not prototype yet. <laughs>